Hi, it's Johan and I'm back again with another two minute drill. I was thinking about a few years ago when I was approached by a management team. It's a big uh, European airline. And we're talking and they asked me, what is the biggest obstacle you have as a leader? What do you think is the hardest for you? And uh, I guess I have a lot of obstacles uh, really, but one of them I think was not having the context of what I'm supposed to be doing. And they said, what do you mean? Well, I gave an example. I said, imagine this, you have a management team and they, they all have a, in front of them a bowl of fruit. They can all see it's a bowl of fruit. But um, in order to delegate that and get the organization working, they split it up. So some takes the bananas, some takes the oranges and so on. And they all peel it and slice it and make it easy for me to understand. And what happens really is that on my table, it ends up like fruit salad. I don't even see that there's a bowl of fruit from the beginning. It doesn't even come at the same time. If I knew there was a bowl of fruit, I can plan, I can organize, I can delegate that to my team in an easy way. But to be honest, it's very hard to de delegate something if you don't know why you're doing it. And there's no context really. So I think as a leader, you're responsible for the context. You're responsible for explaining that there is a bowl of fruit. And in order for people to do the best work and be empowered to do that, they need to have the context, they need to see the whole picture and also the immediate objective, of course. But your responsibility, I would say, starts with the context and the bowl of fruit. Please comment and let me know your thoughts.